Oh my what? Gosh. Fucking twisted, oh man. Oh my god. It's very twisted. And the reason why a friend of mine told me to watch it, I called her and said, "What the hell are you doing?" It's the 15 minute morning show podcast in the house. We've got Froggy and Gandhi and Danielle. Scary is nowhere to be found, and that's Where good. Is he? Don't tell him we're doing it. It'll be our little secret. <laughs> there's uh, Scotty B, and there's Nate with a weird look on his face. What's that look on your face? I would say, where's Scary face? Oh. There's Brody, and there's Garrett, and, uh, and there you go. Hello, everyone. Hello. 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 I'm looking for things to talk about. Oh. Was, that a, was that a Pizza Hut cup you just had? It looks like that, right? It the does. Style Pizza yeah, Hut it does. Cup. It does. Those does it great. have like the texture on it? It's got like that kind of like rigid texture. No, it, oh, that would, yeah. it doesn't. Have, it doesn't have a faded Coca Cola logo on the side like they all did. <laughs> yeah. We're so did. good. I love that. And Pizza uh, Hut had that like chipped ice. Do you guys remember? It wasn't cubes yes. or anything. You know what? They have machines that sell that chipped ice. I love it. They're expensive, so I, I didn't get one. I'm like, it's not worth it. But I love that chipped ice. Hmm. Me too. How the, do we find that? Is, is that, that the same as the version? Nugget Ice, like like Chick, Chick Fil A and Sonicaf? I don't know. I don't it's know. Oh, yeah. More like shaved ice. No, so, that's that's little pieces. But the, the chipped ice is, I think that Pizza Hut had like an exclusive on that. I saw oh, really? a rubber chipped ice maker at this store, this craft store I went to the other day. They oh, had no. one what? that had the round, that makes round cubes. One that makes giant There's square no such ones. thing as a round cube. Anyway, keep going. Yeah, <laughs> you mean a ball? Round ball. The, the round cube ball, is square. The square it? cube. <laughs> I know, it's scary. And a chipped Mate, ice maker. I know a chipped ice maker. Is it a machine? It has to be no, a machine. No, it's a rubber. It's a rubber thing. Okay, like so it's going to take you oh, eight yeah. years to make a weekend's worth of chipped ice. Yeah, I need yeah. a right. machine that just shoots that shit right out. Yeah, they make a um, <laughs> they make a countertop version. I think uh, GE Profile makes it. It's a countertop version, and it makes oh the little God. nugget ice that you oh, get at Sonic. Like nugget, no, they're like five thousand dollars a piece. Yeah, Jeez, it's expensive. Just yeah. for ice. All right. Well. Yeah, I don't drink Coke anymore, but I would love a. Pizza Hut Coke right now. They don't have that. It's yeah. Pepsi. It's Pepsi? Yeah. He's yeah, like, Pepsi Scotty owns knows. Pizza Hut and Taco Bell. Oh, yep. yeah. Yeah. The other KFC. day, Alex and I were at, we were at the and bar. KFC, we're, about to, yeah. we're about to order lunch and whatever. And I looked at him. He looked at me and went, yeah, let's do it. We ordered Coca-Cola. I said, can we each have a Coca-Cola? Yeah. I haven't had one in years. It was so good. Oh, so yeah. Awesome. Does anybody know why there's a difference between fountain soda and just straight from the bottle? Yes, like the mix yeah. of the syrup. Yeah. Yes. Yes. Yeah. So yeah. why can't they put that yeah. mix into the bottle? You know what I mean? Well, like I, don't I, it, I don't know if it works. I, th I, I think it, I think if you, it, the way it bubbles it up and it mixes together in right. that glass, I think that evaporates after a few. It just minutes. tastes so much yes. better. And yeah. did you know that if you order a Coke someplace that has Pepsi by contract, they have to say, "Is Pepsi okay?" Oh, yeah. that's why they always say that. Yeah, yeah. yeah. nerd. Also, you might complain. <laughs> hey, Elvis's assistant David Katz will not drink. It's Pepsi, right? He will not drink Pepsi. I didn't so if know you that. brought him a Pepsi, he'll send it back. He only drinks Diet Coke. Why well, did he know? I, I didn't know he was my assistant. Oh. I was thinking. Uh, I'm, the same sorry, thing. I, I'm so I sorry. No I'm I sorry. I meant. I meant your partner. I meant your, your partner. partner. I'm so sorry. Sorry, phone, David. <laughs> sorry, David. <laughs> do Do you think he would know the difference? Yes. 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 Yeah. I would. He would. Yeah. I can I tell the too. difference. And yeah. I, I got to be honest with you. I like both Coke and Pepsi. Yeah. I'm fine. I can drink both. Didn't you take the Pepsi challenge in the '80s, Danielle? Come on. No, I don't think I did. I used to be able to tell the difference between a Pepsi out of a can, out of a two-liter bottle, and out of the fountain. Mm -hmm. Ooh, you that's do that. talent. No. I You're always hot. think McDonald's has the best Coke. <laughs> Something about a big ass McDonald's Coke is better than anybody oh. else's Coke. It's just the best. So, one. can I tell you a secret totally. about the soda fountains? Mm -hmm. Sure. Having Wait, worked in can restaurants. Can we handle the truth? <laughs> well, Danielle may not like it. So, you know where the logos are, where it says like Coke and Sprite and Fanta, whatever the flavors are? You take that cap off, and there's two screws, one to adjust the syrup. And one to adjust the seltzer. So you can you can set it to whatever you want, make it extra sweet or not as sweet. But if you don't clean those because oh. the syrup builds up in there, I've been in places where when you take the cap off, it's all uh, roaches and bugs running around. Okay, right really? Yes, yep. I can I can actually do that for that. Because oh I gosh. similarly worked in a place like that. And we had to clean those regularly. <sighs> So, have fun drinking your fountain sodas, folks. And did you know that Waffle House claims to have the freshest Coke? I don't even know how that's possible. It's not a thing. It's well, <laughs> that's what they say. I like those ones at the movie theater. When you go to like the uh, the movie theater and they have all the different flavors, they can flavor your seltzer. Oh, the Coke stuff. machines. Yeah, yeah. Those, yeah, that's cool. I like that one. The remix thing. Hey, last time you were at Epcot, you went to that Coca-Cola uh, rotunda oh. that has all the sodas from around the world. And you Vomit. have little cups and you can taste little sodas from Ooh, everywhere. That would be awesome. That's so terrible. Cool. No, it's not. 
Fun it's fact. It's not what? terrible. It's very Why good. Is that not it's good? very good. Well, then, you know, I tell you what, don't go. Don't go. But, you know, if, you, if you want to, it's, it's actually good. I think that's like, so cool. Um, yeah, like Mexican Coke versus Mexican, American Coke. It's yeah. so good. It's I like it so good. much better. But what Brody's complaining about is actually accurate. Some of those sodas from around the world are like, and they drink yeah. it every day. So, I'm like, oh, God. Okay. And to Gandhi's yes. point, uh, the Thanks. Mexican yep. Coke that comes in the glass bottle, they use pure cane sugar because high fructose corn syrup is illegal in Mexico and most countries. But we are. <laughs> able to, we are allowed to use it here in America. So that's why American Coke say, tastes so much different. So buy the glass bottle of uh, Mexican Coke. I feel like Scotty would know the answer to this. So you remember New Coke? Yes. Yeah. Okay. Yes. So it was this thing in what the eighties or that's correct. Okay. Eighty four. So the maybe. theory, the conspiracy theory is that they use new Coke to change people's palate so that when they brought back the as sweet Coca Cola, it would have the high fructose corn syrup in it in it. And people wouldn't notice the change. I had not heard oh. that, but I just remember it was not as sweet. The Correct. New, yeah. But they used that little hiccup. Like a transition period? Yeah, so that when they so brought they back from sugar to, to... Exactly. Do you think that maybe it accidentally did that, did that so they pretended to take credit for it? Oh, we right. had this great psychological <laughs> fuck maybe. people. Well, if you want me to check, I bought a new Coke can on eBay, and I have it in my basement. Why? Spot. I would, what I the I hell? Why did it. you do that? I don't know. Why do you do things like this that? This is why Amy, Amy complains it's about you. Right. 40 years old. God, yeah, no, it's empty, but I have the can. How much? Hey, well, you know, I want to talk about that movie Fresh for just a moment. Mm-hmm. And I mean, can, can we go ahead and just spoil alert the fuck sure. out of this? All right. So if you, if you want to see Fresh, we're about to talk about it. So you guys don't care, right? No. no, no. no. You're sure? Yeah. yeah. So I don't, I don't want to like ruin it for anyone. No, you but, already kind of said it Well, sucked, the, the, so. the synopsis is out there. It, there's no secret. This guy, he, kids, he kidnaps women, and he sells their meat to very, very wealthy guys around the world. Does he kill them? Slowly. Well, if he's, he sells yeah. their meat, he's probably he has killing to kill them. them yeah. Scotty. He, yeah, but no, he he takes it off bit by bit. You know, he, oh. he keeps them al- and keeps them alive. Oh, huh? he tortures them then. Well, not really tortures. Just takes their meat. <laughs> I guess, in essence, it could be considered torture. Okay. Yeah, that's gotta hurt. The thing is, uh, these old pervy fuckers uh, around the world—they open the box, right? And there's like a pair of her undergarments, and there's like a picture of her. Uh, I mean, it's really awful. And then there's the meat. You know, you can get breast meat, you can get thigh meat, you know, all the meat you can get off of an animal. Oh my gosh. And anyway, so he finally kidnaps one woman, and he, he does end up taking her ass off, but, and they, he eats it, but uh, he falls in love <laughs> with her. Is that a rump roast? He falls in love with her. Oh, which even was, though she of has course, no ass? If even well, and you know what? It was you know his downfall because he fell in love with someone who you know figured out how to get out of there. Uh, Ugh. Is it cooked? Yes. Did he dunk it, dunk it in gravy? Oh. Yes. Okay. Do they? Do they? Do they? Made meatballs and things out of it, and sausages oh, okay. and. Oh. Oh. Why would anyone want to watch it? This, this? is a whole. This we is... talked about this on the air not too long ago. This is like a whole subculture on the dark web of people who want to be eaten, and the people who chop, chop them up and eat them. Oh They're right. like the butchers Can searching for the long pigs. I can't, it's I can't. creepy. It's, it's a whole disgusting. thing. Disgusting. And of course, I don't know for fact that there is a market for you know human meat out there. <sighs> yeah, I, but, hey, you uh, know what? Yeah. Sorry. No, what's that? Uh, Scary and I talked about this on the Brooklyn Boys last week. He was saying something where he said, I don't know how anyone could like that. And I said, Scary, there are people that watch poop movies. Yeah. There are people that watch horrible murder films. Right. Whatever there is in the world, yeah. there's someone who yeah. likes it. And you just reiterated that. Whatever you can put on film... Someone is going to go, oh, I like that. I'm into that. Someone's going to help think about it. Somebody my, likes it. My dad always said there's an ass for every chair. Yep. Except for that woman because she lost yeah. her ass. Yeah. She <laughs> got shaved off and eaten a yeah, but she <laughs> lo- <laughs> Do you know how we get promo things for movies sometimes? <laughs> Nate. Yeah. Oh, so Fresh <laughs> wanted to do a promo yeah. and, and post about it. What they wanted to send me was steaks. Yeah, that's not good. <laughs> I said no because that's disgusting. I've heard human meat is a lot like pork. How? Don't. Who told who, you that? You heard, heard about it you hear that from? Yeah, who well, heard I'm sure, it? I'm I've sure heard. someone could tell you without eating it. They, they just know the contents or they know the makeup of our yeah. flesh and they could see, compare it. 
I heard that human meat is absolutely disgusting and most animals don't even want it. Some can't digest it because we eat such crap and we have all this different chemical stuff oh, in us and we taste terribly. Yeah, yeah, that's why I only eat terrible. acorns. Yes. <laughs> so animals would love to eat meat. I would like there to eat part of myself just to see what oh. I taste like. Oh, oh, oh by the way, say that, Nate. The, the ultimate in vanity. You've tried. The guy, by the way, does get his, he gets his dick bitten off. <laughs> what? Back oh. to does you. he die? <laughs> this movie of sounds terrible. terrible. Everyone said to me... Hey, spoiler they, alert. You know, no, they I said... T- I was very, very clear earlier. <laughs> yeah, he, was. Spoiler. He, no, he died. No, they were like, hey, you're never going to want to eat meat again. So I in, I immediately thought it was about the meat industry. Not like this, this well, fictitious drama it is. about... It's meat. about the women's meat industry. Cannibalism! Oh. It's awful. Cannibalism is not fictitious, though, Scary. Right. True. No. No, what happened? People who still like to do that. Yeah. He was asked though, do guys, oh, do pe- do men, or does anyone ever order men's meat? And his answer was, nah, there's no market for that. <laughs> <laughs> no really? You know, the, t- the TV show Yellow Jacket, Yellow Jackets delves into that a little bit, but that's considered a great show because they handle it differently. But there's some cannibalism in that show as well, I believe. Well, also, there's another, there's another storyline going on, and it's yeah. how w- women are treated, and it's, like, it's awful. I mean, it, that really is the baseline. Well, they're getting women, kidnapping them, and turning them into dinner. How Wait a minute. How, how, was how they're treated or pre-treated? <laughs> yes. How Marinated. they're brined. Yeah. What's um, that, Danielle? How, like, is the acting good? Like, when the women have their, like, <laughs> <laughs> skin cut off and stuff, are they like, ah, well, ah? Is, is it, it Oscar-worthy? Yeah. No, you know what? He, <laughs> No, they, it's they no don't, centipede. They they don't show a lot of pain. But they, oh, they, they give don't? they give them epidurals and then Oh, they, well, at least so he does that. So they're awake. Their eyes are open oh. and they know that their ass is being cut this off. This is so oh fucking gosh. twisted, oh man. Oh my god. It's very twisted. And the reason why a friend of mine told me to watch it, I called her and said, "What the hell are you doing?" But you never question, again wait, will I watch a movie you told me to watch. Once your ass is cut off, what's there? The inner workings know. are still there. I mean, flat. But what did he they do? Uh, never mind. I don't know. Probably looks like my ass normally. When <laughs> yeah, my ass. Daniel. <laughs> Daniel, maybe we, maybe someone ate our asses. <laughs> maybe. Just thinking. well, well. Uh, <laughs> do you tell? Hey, but the the guy that stars in this is uh, the the guy the guy the actor. He's Sebastian the Winter Soldier. Stan. Sebastian Stan. Yeah. Please yeah. tell me that this isn't doing well in their. No, in their, their well, top no we're talking lists. about the actor. Hold on a second. The, the guy who's in uh, Pam uh, and Tommy. Pam and Sebastian Tommy. Sebastian Tommy Lee. Love that. Sebastian He's great. Stan. Just kind of chose the weird movie on this one. You What's your question, Anderson, Anderson's going to be on Broadway? Yes. Yes. Yeah. I'm just saying, I really hope this is not at the top of the list as far as what's doing well. and It is actually doing is. really yeah, well. People yeah. are warped, man. Yeah. Well, I, wow. a lot of people watch it because they hear the hype and then they regret watching it. Just like that Ben Affleck movie. Everyone's saying so that's it's a... a it's a turd. Yeah, turds swirling around. Is it better than Zombievers? <laughs> I don't know. I'm sure it's right up there. Zombievers wasn't that bad. Yes, it was. <laughs> Nail. Nail. And just to think, I was going steak shopping today. And I think I'm yeah, I know. I'm becoming as as a vegetarian today. As, as long as they're not from women, I think you're okay. Yeah, How do you good, know? Scary. That's true. I think you know. Wait a minute. Is <laughs> Hebrew National a Jewish guy? Know? So, hold on. I got a question, Elvis. <laughs> Did you get a side of panties oh, with God. your steaks there, Scary? Oh, come on. I don't use that word. <laughs> um, Elvis, <laughs> do, do, do they show any of the meat like as, as they sell it or whatever? Oh, yeah. So, does it look like a, like, can you tell the difference? Does it look like steak? Does it look no, it's more, meat. What does it, it look like? meat. Meat. Does, does it, it look like pork? Or it chicken? looks like meat. I mean, is I it a red meat, a white meat? What if, color? It, it doesn't look like red meat, it's, though. It's too red. close to home for me. I don't want to see. I wonder that. if we've ever eaten something that we don't know. I don't know. You asked me eaten. a question. I'm trying to answer it. I yeah. was just, yeah. just go to the butcher's. <laughs> just go to the butcher department of a grocery store, and you'll see what I saw. I okay. guarantee oh. we've all eaten human. No, 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 before. no! Don't say no, that. No, like it probably somebody lost a finger and it got ground probably. up in hot dogs or something. Yeah, I guarantee. Probably. I guarantee that's happening. Ew. I'm probably right. This says, human flesh looks like beef, but the taste is more elusive. Well, I don't like that I don't word. Taste elusive. <laughs> yeah, I'm, I'm, going, I'm going to. Elusive s- means it runs away. Well, I, I mean, if you so. think, of, honestly, if you think about it, we eat the flesh of animals. So, like. Yeah. yeah we do. Animal. I, I think about it. It's disgust, not people. It's kind of but disgusting. we do know for a fact also that some animals taste different than others. And right. I guess it could be a cultural thing that what you're used to and right. you know. So who would taste the best in this room then? Scary. 
Scary. Scary as well. Scary's got a lot of garlic and and marinated. Yeah, keep in mind, he's first quarter Scary, so you've got a lot of sugars and proteins. Garrett takes really good care of himself, somewhat. He he, he works out. He Mm. doesn't eat uh, gluten. He's a diabetic. Oh, yeah. He he used to be a, a great swimmer. I don't know. I would eat Garrett. But that means no, you're Garrett's, gluten Garrett's free, low on Garrett's low on gluten, but he's low on sugar. I want some sweetness. Yeah, like if we're if we're going for like a veal type of thing, we need the one with the least movement. So that yeah. would be scary, right? Yeah. <laughs> well, hold on. Let's go back to Garrett. Garrett, let's talk about your sugar, the sugar in your body. Yes. You're, you can't regulate it. I mean, you have to regulate it. Yeah, I, I do right? with uh, with my insulin, which is in the other room right now. Uh, but I don't need it. Uh, but yeah, I have to regulate Dude, I, it. I would I, think you'd be sweeter than others then. Well, it, it, okay. it's it, well, it's it's sugar from a pig. So that, that that's oh. what uh, that's what my so it's got a little bit of a pork so. taste to it. Maybe. Yeah, it has a pork taste. He's winning me <laughs> over. I'm back on Team Garrett. <laughs> okay. Candied right. Garrett. Yeah. See now, if Garrett. I was to order though, like you said, this guy lets you order. I would order a Scary's calves because I feel like I'd get a lot for my buck. We could order those now. He's got oh. plenty to spare. Jeez. I know. Yeah. That's he, not true. I don't know. I think calves may cost a lot per pound because you're buying per pound. You're not oh, buying right. a lot of bone mm-hmm. calf. Plus, that would be like. Pound. Muscly, right, and a little like yeah. tough to Maybe. chew. What, oh, what about like, the chin meat? cheeks or like yeah, his chin? Yeah. Maybe some underarm. Maybe some belly. Cheeks. Yeah. I got great cheeks. Look at this. I need to go back to my surgeon. <laughs> Scary. They always see your calves, but you never get to answer. Like who? Uh, so, uh, would you eat your own calves no, at no, that point? No, I would not. Then who would you eat? I wouldn't. Eat, I wouldn't eat anybody in you this room. You have to. You have to pick somebody, Scare. Jesus. This is your oh. chance. I'd go yep. Gandhi. Oh. Yeah, Gandhi. All right. We love Indian. Yeah. yeah, there's a spicy rub on there. There probably oh. would be some what flavor to it. A spicy rub. What is she bathing curry? Scary. It's what is a, that? You know, a trip to Flavor Town. You're right. <laughs> All right. Are we done? Yeah. yeah. Well, we, we were done a while ago, but yeah, we're done. Bye. 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 We're, we're now more done than ever. Well Comment done. below. Who would you eat? Goodbye. Bye.